Oh, hello. Well, this is it. This is the night we all try and stay awake to find out how Father Christmas gets those presents that we've been dreaming of for so long into our stockings. He never puts any in mind. I think they pong a bit too much for his liking. <laughs> never mind. His presents will be with us one way or another, I'm sure of that. Now, my present to you right now is a Christmas greeting on this Christmas Eve. Number one on my list is, join me. Our lovely wee letter here that came in from uh, Logie Drive in Larbert, and it says, Dear Glenn, would you please say hello to my two children, Ross, who's eight, and Greer, who's five, on your Christmas cavalcade? Okay, they really enjoy your show, and we'll be delighted to have a mention and see their photographs on television. Well, there's your photographs. And Merry Christmas to you all, says Wendy Robertson. Thank you, Mrs. Robertson. And you've got a little PS there. You say, here, there are no drawings, but the only thing I can draw with any success is my family allowance. <laughs> I like it. Merry Christmas to you. Here's another one. It says, Happy Christmas here. That's a nice card, isn't it? I'm going to put it down because it's a birthday wish on the 27th of December for Stephen Jameson. There you are. And uh, big brother David, who's going to be, what, nine on the 18th of January. Uh, they never missed the show once again. That's very nice of you. Love from my mum, dad, and his four big brothers and all we will stay at your home, of course, at Eglinton Square in our Drossen in Ayrshire. Two lovely little photographs of you. Uh, a nice birthday wish to you both and a Christmas card to me. Thank you. It may be Christmas Eve, but we can still find things that bring us entertainment this happy Yuletide. So, what's up? And, well, I think the first thing you could go to for a change from any pantomime is a super circus. Now, that's the Robert Brothers Circus, and it's on at the Scottish Exhibition Centre in Glasgow. And that consists of all oh, trapeze artists, there are jugglers, there are clowns, there's even dog acts. And they can be very good if they're treated really well. Also horses, ponies. And if you really want to uh, see some elephants, well, they have magnificent elephants there, trained by Bobby Roberts himself. Really marvellous. So that's a super. And also Jack and the Beanstalk there with Jimmy Logan and Una McLean at the Edinburgh Kings. And that's a lovely pantomime, and you'd enjoy that if you fancy a pantomime, all right? So there's two of the things you can see this Christmas. <laughs> I know you're watching television at this very moment, but have you ever thought what it would be like to shout your head off at a hero and boo the baddie? You're even asked to do that in some pantomimes, and to find out more about how you can do that, I have a couple of guests with me today who can answer that question for you. Now, boom! <laughs> Hello. Uh, hi, hello. We Glenn. are the McIlvaney McLeish twins. Yes. My name is Victor. And I'm Daddy. Oh, yes. very good. You're eight. How yes. old are you, Glenn? Uh, I'd rather not mention it, if you oh, don't uh, mind. Yes. Eight. Yes. yes. And short trousers. Yes. I see. Excuse yes. me, but what are you supposed to be? I mean, it says Baz and Vic. Well, I know Vic. that, but I mean, Vic, that's short, you know, like... Short for Bar. Yeah, yeah, like Glay would be short for Glay. Oh, I see, Baz I see. is short for Baddy. Well, you're appearing in... At the Tron, Tron Theatre. Theater. In Babes in the Wood Babes. by Alan Cumming and Forbes Mass, and they're very good. Yes, and, you did, yeah. uh, I don't know, I don't know. But uh, we're on until January the 10th. Is that right? Yes. yes. I see. <laughs> who, who, who plays the Babes in, in, in the Wood? Well, we do. Oh, we you do? do? Sorry, yes. Oh, I see. I'm dressed like this. I yes. see. Oh. And do you, do you get involved with the children, or do the children get involved yes. with you, or what happens? Oh, well, it's a big adventure. Yes, lots of things happen. And everyone has to help us get back to our homes in Kelvin's Side. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yes. yes, you're enjoying it. Yes, it's great. Yes. And, except it's scary because there's a baddie, mm -hmm. a baddie person in it called Professor Vivian Section, and he's awful evil. Baddie. And we've got to fight him. Oh, I need the toilet. Victor. <laughs> oh, sakes. <laughs> well, uh, anybody else in the show at all? Yes, there's a magic seagull. Magic and, seagull? Yes, called Morena. And there's a rabbit called Warren and a chicken called Marshall. I see. <laughs> and what do they do exactly? Oh, well, they help us in our fight against evil. Fighting along evil. with the boys and girls. It yes. sounds a very complicated uh, sort of production, is it? Well, it's not really, you don't have to be very clever to understand no. You it. could come along if you yes, want. Yes, you might understand it. Yeah, yes, that's very kind of you. Thank you very much. Okay. And where, where's this appearing again, so the At boys the, and girls? The Tron Theatre in Glasgow. Glasgow. And it's on 7.30 and there's some matinees at 2.30. Now, you just say it's a family pantomime? Or yes, is it a pantomime yes. indeed? Yes, it's yes, a pantomime. A pantomime yes. Yes. And it's for everybody. Everybody, everybody will everybody. like it. Jolly good. That's very kind. And your names are again there? Victor and Barry. Very nice. May I shake your hand? It's You've got a bad nice memory. Or something. Yes, it's very nice, <laughs> nice to have you here today. Whew, so now, you... <laughs> thank you, Victor and Barry. Not at all. Oh look! Oh look! There's us. Oh yes. 